Hello, my name is Oliver Hutchison and I'm a year 8 student homeschooling with Wolsey Hall living in England. Today I'm going to show you a day in my life as a homeschool student. Wait, what are you doing here? No, I, I told you to not come here today. Leave. Leave. <sighs> Leave Fine. Now. now that he's gone to go get ready for normal school, we can properly start my morning routine. Now the first thing that I normally do when I get up is I get in the shower to clear my head and get ready for the day. It also helps me to wake up as normally I'm pretty sleepy in the morning. Once I've done this, I'll put some clothes on, brush my teeth, and then I'll be totally ready to start the day. At 9 o'clock I begin my studies and I go over to my shelf where I keep all of my books and folders stored. I always start with science. I then check canvas to see if there's been any updates made. I then click on science and go to my next bit of work that I need to do. Today is revision and making sure I'm prepared for the quiz and assignment. I spend the next hour doing some revision and going over what I've done in the topic. I make sure that I understand what I've learned before moving on. A pro tip to all homeschoolers out there is when doing revision, avoid any distractions such as music that you might normally play when you're doing work. This will totally make sure that you're taking in the revision that you're doing instead of taking in the amazing music that you're listening to. After an hour of work, I then go get my morning snack break, which usually consists of a yoghurt. I then have a 15 minute break where I can relax and do whatever I want before starting my next lesson. My next lesson was maths, which only took me 40 minutes, so I got through it reasonably quickly. I really enjoy maths and it's one of my more favourite subjects. I usually do it with my dad. I finished with a tiny bit of consolidation before getting ready for lunch. At this point, I was really hungry. When I can, I try to help my family cook the lunch, but usually my mum and dad are the ones who make it whilst we're doing our schoolwork. At lunchtime, me and my brothers, my mum and sometimes my dad all come together to eat lunch. This is a really nice time for us all to socialise and talk about what we've been doing during the morning. We then had a small break after lunch before starting our afternoon lessons. But one of the reasons why I love Wolsey Hall is it gives you the flexibility to do something else if you want. We decided during the afternoon to work on some activities that we had going on. My brothers decided to work on their assignments whilst I worked on this video that you're watching right now. I love the opportunities that Wolsey Hall gives us just like these as it varies a balance between learning and having fun. After we've done all our work for the day, me and my brothers always love to get on some games in the evening and play with our friends. Some of our favourite games are FIFA, Valorant and Fortnite. I love getting on and playing with my brothers as it's a really nice way to end the day socially. I love playing games and if I had to choose a platform to play them on it would definitely be the PC. By 9.30 we will have finished playing our games and we'll be upstairs brushing our teeth and getting ready for bed. I'll spend some time upstairs watching YouTube and then reading a book before I go to sleep at around 10 or 10.30. The next day we repeat all of these steps again and this is my life as a homeschool student. Once all of the coronavirus pandemic has cleared up, we would love to travel and do homeschooling. We love going to Singapore and really enjoy travelling around the world to different countries. I would like to thank you very, very much for watching this video and I hope it has given you an interesting insight as to the life of a homeschool student. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the Wolsey Hall Oxford YouTube channel down below and also leave a like. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.